we're on our way to get a gelato from a place called Papagero. I heard that they had the best gelato in town. It's right here in the corner of 13th and Samson. And along 13th and Samson, you'll see so many restaurants and shops, so many vintage places that would just, any person's appetite for art, food, whatever, it pleases it. So follow me people, we're on our way to Cafe Giro. We'll let you know how good it is. Hi, we're sitting outside of um, Cafe Giro. We just left out. We have um, a small here, gelato. Um, the small runs you around six bucks, but it's well worth every penny. I have the um, Caribbean Sunrise and the papaya. I got a mix and it's actually really, really delicious. The taste is like an explosion of food in your mouth and it's so creamy. It's just simply delicious. If you come here, you have to go to Cappuccino. Um, This is actually a really happening spot in Philadelphia. We're on the corner of, again, like I said, of 17th and Samson. You have um, a hot spot called El Vez. I heard really wonderful things about El Vez. So that's going to be one of the places we'll visit a little later. So you'll see that. And also, um, there's a vintage wine bar a couple of um, stores down. You'll see that right behind us, there's a sushi and, uh, sushi and sake lounge. So um, this end of the street actually has like every restaurant for every table. So um, again, if you want a really good dessert that's tasty and that like soothes you on a hot day, come here for gelato, Capogero. For those wondering exactly what is gelato, well, gelato is the Italian version of ice cream. The difference is between ice cream and gelato is that gelato is has a creamier, silkier texture to it, whereas ice cream doesn't. At Capogiro, there are 368 flavors to choose from, and you have at least 13 to 15 flavors to choose from daily, so the flavors do change. Gelato is served either in a cup or a cone, so if you're not one who wants just that cup, go for the cone.